the weekday lunchbox with Dave Jameson. We were t- we were just talking about the the wine there because you you, you are wine specialist. Yes, yeah, that's, that's an awful lot of people talk a lot of rubbish about wine, don't they? Sure, they do. And you know, one of the things about wine is that a lot of people try to you know be professors about, it and you know, it, we're, we're really kind of like your your friends in the wine business, and you, we want we talk to people about buying wine on a on a. Easier kind of level. just talking about like what goes. I mean, if you're eating this type of food, this is the kind of wine you drink with it, and it's just just really a basic, simple thing. We do write tasting notes just to give people an idea of what to look out for, but we don't want wine to be scary at all. We mm. want people to, you know, when the wine list comes, it shouldn't be the biggest decision of your life. You, you should know. say, oh. Albarino, that's you know that's crisp. It's refreshing. It's lemony. I'm going to have a bottle of that with my bucarones. But you today. Mu- you must like to experiment as well and and, and choose oh. something you've never had before. Sure, yeah. we, we try that all the time. We and do. That's what makes it fun. You know, Dave, we're really very honored because there's a book that we did a, a compilation. The Fire Island Cookbook is our first book. But the compilation was called The Ultimate Wine Companion, The Complete Guide to Wine by the wine, uh, world's foremost authorities. And we were one of 40 of the authors. And in, including, you know, the, Jancis Robinson, uh, Oz Clark, Oz Clark yeah. uh, Robert Parker. And we were included in that book. So, yeah. so but we, we talk to people on a really easy level about enjoying wine and pairing it with food because wine is really meant to be enjoyed. At the end of the day, it's what you like yourself, isn't exactly. it? Yes, exactly. Yes, it exactly. is. Absolutely. Guys, stay with us. We'll get that question from you in about five minutes' time. Uh, the weather the forecast is next. You want the news as it happens. 2.33 is the time, 27 minutes to 3 on a Friday afternoon from Coastline. My guests have been Mike and Jeff in this hour. We've been talking food and talking about their uh, book, the Fire Island uh, uh, Fire Island Cookbook. Uh, summing up the book in a couple of sentences, what's it all about? It is a summer entertaining cookbook. There's 14 dinner party menus, um, and it's really easy summer entertaining. For the most part, the dishes are made to be prepared in the morning. So you can do a little prep cooking in the morning, um, marinate your meat, chop your vegetables. And go to the beach and spend the whole day in the waves with your family and friends. And then you come back in the evening, and basically you you know you walk home, you you light the grill, you turn on the stove, and get a little you know heat under your pasta pot or, or your your rice pot. Take a shower. Your friends walk in the door, oh. and dinner. Ready. And don't forget, get a glass of wine in your hand. Glass of cold as, wine. You know, as soon right. as you get out of the shower. And please, no ingredients that I have to send to Nicaragua for. No, Not no, all. they're all. They're mm. actually all of the ingredients there are, are things. I mean, certainly locally sourced. Locally here sourced. In Nerha. Anything you can find in a grocery store. We are so lucky here with the fresh fruit and veg. Aren't oh, we? Yes, absolutely. So lucky. Well, the book's called The Fire Island Cookbook. It's by Mike and Jeff. I've been talking to. They'll be down at Bar H Two O tomorrow night signing copies. That's on Buriana Beach in Nerka. But if you want to win a copy, the guys have got a question to ask. Ask, you call me or email me, and uh, we'll pick one name out of the hat before three o'clock, and that person will win the book. So, guys, what's the question? Oh, what's the question? The question okay. is, how many bottles of wine are there in a Magnum? How many bottles of wine in a Magnum? If you know, 952-533-544, studio at coastline.fm. All the correct answers in a hat, and we'll find a winner before the end of the hour. Guys, thank you very much. Hope it goes well, and I uh, look forward to seeing you tomorrow Dave, night. Thanks so much, and we're looking forward to seeing all of our friends tomorrow down at H2O. Gabby, Alex... Matt, Lily, Simon. Matt, Simon, and, and, and we certainly hope that whoever wins the book can stop by. Coastline FM.